Do you want to be a plumber working hour by hour, your hands in the toilet, really trying to make as much money as possible for you to, you know, make rent? Or do you want to sit back and get money coming in <laughs> into your bank account on a monthly basis and you just having to do a couple of videos here and there? Well, in this conversation with Jeff Lenning, who basically went from being an Excel guy, maybe even a little bit of a CPA, all the way to sitting back having 900 people a month pay $29 a month. Now think about that. $900 a month or so, people paying, yes, people paying $29 a month. Think about that. So he's going to explain kind of his journey, and it's an interesting journey, and also really some of the specifics. So I think you're going to learn a little bit about marketing. You're going to little, learn a little bit about, well, what he's made of Excel from basically – <laughs> not much work as he says it. It's an incredible story. Sit back, relax. I think you'll be very glad that you took the time to learn a little bit about his journey. Once again, Kenner French of vastsolutionsgroup.com. Really appreciate you taking the time to hang out with us. Hey, kids, you know how you have a struggling time with Excel and you just can't quite figure it out and it drives you crazy? This dude, Jeff Lenning, has totally figured it out, and more than anything, he's figured it out in a way that's completely helped his business. I don't even think he understands what he's done. I like what he's done so much. Anyway, thanks a lot for being here, Jeff. Hey, thanks. It's great to be back. All right, yeah, this is the second time you've been here. I love the discussion the first time. I said, dude, you have to come back. Um, really quickly, why don't you mention a little bit about your, your journey, and then we could get into kind of some of the specifics that I find so unbelievable, and it can be so applicable to so many of our viewers and listeners who are mainly entrepreneurs, all entrepreneurs really. Cool. Well, I'll give the super concise version then. Basically, for me, it's, it's been all about efficiency. And so the big tool for that was Excel. Um, I used Excel in my role as the accounting manager to get our monthly close from two weeks to two days. I was like, oh my goodness, this is insane. So I wanted to help other people do what I did. So I wrote articles, books, and now I set up a whole online uh, Excel training platform. That's exactly right. And I think of you as a marketer, but I don't think you think of yourself as a marketer because what you've done, in my opinion, would be the analogy of someone being a great plumber, right? Let's say someone's a killer plumber and all of a sudden they've turned the plumbing, you know, instead of going in someone's house to, you know, turn wrenches, put their hand down the, down the toilet, let's just say, all of a sudden they've turned it into a community that's got recurring revenue and it's killing it. That's basically what you've done in Excel. You get me? Yeah. That's basically right, right? Because yeah. I take the skill of using Excel to then helping other people use it, not only just like in person, like trading dollars for hours, right. but now it's this membership kind of a platform, correct? Yeah. And we're basically trying to do the same thing or just about to do the same thing. We'll get into that in a little bit because we're going to be here for whatever, about a half an hour. So, so instead of you being a consultant, going in, going physically into an office, showing people how to do an Excel spreadsheet and automating it, what you have. I guess really going on is people go to a, whatever, a, at least a monthly, I think maybe twice a month meet up online virtually, I believe. And really therefore that's where you get your passive income, which is totally different than if you're, you know, trading time for dollars in being uh, working on the Excel spreadsheet in someone's office, basically. Exactly. 100% right. So like as right. an accountant, like I, my roots are as a CPA and an accountant, mm -hmm. every job I've had has been trading dollars for my time hourly employee, like the whole deal, billable hours, all that stuff. And now it's just different. I've built out this platform with all the pre-recorded videos so people can train on demand. Plus then I bring in the live Zoom calls, you know, for office hours. Yep. And we're doing the same thing. We're starting this community called Vast Vault. We have, oh, I'm going to do, I'm going to mention three different things. We have, we're, we always are going to be emailing or blast emailing people, number one. And then number two, we have a free community that you could get in and into the community. It's free. You could get content. You hear from me and this other guy I'll mention uh, down the road uh, once a month, or you could do a paid community where it's $29 a month. You get a lot of stuff. You get access to our library, all of our content, exclusive content, et cetera, et cetera. So we're trying to do the same thing. Actually, it's being launched as we speak. So uh, I'm very interested personally. And also I think a lot of our people could be taking advantage of what you're doing in their industry. We have at least 2000 real estate agents and we have that we 
or let's say a one to one communication with, and then we have another eighteen hundred that we they kind of know who we are through a strategic alliance. So I think a lot of those people could be doing what you're doing in that instead of going and selling a house, they could be coaching or training investors or training, let's say, as a real estate uh, agent, they could be training um, uh, you know people how to buy houses instead of going and showing houses. You know they could. You make it so that the people do it themselves and they get a coaching fee or whatever the case is. And I think that's brilliant what you've done. Cause you could, I think you were in, mm, was it Disneyland last time we talked? I mean, you're, you, you get to chill out basically and coaching your jammies if you want, you know, <laughs> for sure. Well, first of all, good luck with your project. And second Thanks. of all, I'm happy to be fully transparent and provide any of the tools, the process, all the mistakes I learned along the way, like this definitely did not come together overnight. So hit me up, man. I'll give you all the insight. Well, how did you do – so like for us, we have our existing clients coming in. We have luckily business coming in. But it's scary to make that transition to all of a sudden $29 a month. You know what I mean? So like how, how did you do that actually to make that transition? Yeah, so the the evolution of that kind of model for me started with what I'll call live launches and course sales. So it looked more like this. I give a weekly um, email that has zero sales. It's all just Excel tips and knowledge. Mm -hmm. And then like two times a year or maybe three times a year, I would do a live launch, which means I would do live webinars like five times, like over the course of a week, like five different live sessions. And I would um, invite people to take this paid course. And then that would close down. And then the revenue would just drop to like this, right? Yeah. And then I'd wait like three or six months and then I'd do this whole big promotional splash and try to um, convince people to come in and take training. And so the revenue was very volatile and it was very stressful because like you're doing this live ramp and then, and then sales just kind of trail off. Then I transitioned over to what I'll just call like this more evergreen model which is what I'm on now, which is more of a subscription membership type of concept rather than these live launches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then how much is it? I forgot. How much is it per per month? Or I uh, know. Yeah. How often do you bill, by the way? Yeah. So I have two plans, monthly or annual, and there's different training passes. So it goes for, they start at 29 a month. That's what, oh, same months. as us. Oh, I got it. Um, yeah, I, I totally hear you. Um, and you have Matt, like thousands. How many people do you have uh, on an ongoing basis? Yeah, it kind of varies, but somewhere between 700 and 900 active mm. subscribers. That's unbelievable. That uh, is unbelievable. And by the way, what platform do you use if you feel comfortable enough to mention it? Yeah, I'll tell you all the tech tools I use because trust me, it was very much like a, a work in progress. But now mm. kind of where I've landed is for the actual course material the videos and all that stuff it goes through an lms so it's a proper like learning management system mm. complete with quizzing activities mm. activity completion like all the things that you would need to provide effective training and that lms is uh, openlms.net mm -hmm. and it's um it's a proper like hosted professional solution so they do all the updates and they do all the technical like things Mm, I understand. I understand. And you supply the content. And I bet you the content, a lot of your content or some is based on the stuff you do every day, I bet, and that you can put on there as content, correct? Yeah, exactly right. So like I'm in Excel, mm -hmm. like all, all the time, like every day. <laughs> yeah. I'm also in Google Sheets like every day. So I'm just in spreadsheets yeah. like all, all the time. And so correct, as I'm learning new things myself or as Excel releases or Microsoft releases new Excel features, yep. I'm keeping things updated by incorporating those new videos. Yeah. What about AI? Are you using AI? We use AI for a variety of internal things. Mm. Um, and then also some of the new lessons uh, or the new videos um, touch on how to implement AI in Excel specifically, mm -hmm. but for my business, yes, I use AI to, uh, for a variety of different things, uh, help me come up with social media captions, help me mm -hmm. translate my video transcript into a blog post, yep. at least a draft. Like my experience with it is that it's not going to give you 100% ready to go, but it certainly yeah. will get you 80% there. And then you just modify it. Yeah, I get it. Uh, do you, do you use uh, anyone offshore to help or no? No, it's just myself and then two U.S. based virtual assistants, and they live in Georgia and Texas. Uh, employees or contractors? Uh, they're ten ninety nine contractors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, dude, you're you got a lot of good stuff going on. Um, 
I, well, by the way, what's going on down the road? What are you going to do to expand, if at all? Yeah, so I have a new batch of courses that I'm planning for, and I'll release those. So the idea is to build on the foundation of efficiency with Excel and mm. then show other tools that are like not Excel, but like adjacent yeah. to Excel that will just mm. help the people who I support be even more efficient. Yeah, because you don't, I, I totally hear because I would think that Excel is killer, but if you could add on something else, I don't know what that something else would be that could get you instead of seven, 900 people, I could get you another 100 or 200 people who'd be interested in whatever said product or service would be. Exactly. And so some of these tools that I'm going to be teaching are more the things I've used internally that are more online than like a desktop mm -hmm. application. Yeah. So there are things like Zapier, Active Campaign, Stealth Seminar, yeah. like all these different tools. And so when you can see how they can all fit together and communicate with each other and like, um, you know, a simple example, I do my YouTube video, I grab mm. the transcript and then AI takes it and creates a blog post that automatically loads it into WordPress. Um, mm -hmm. And there's just so many automations like that that can really just save, right. save a lot of time. That's what I would think. You're really a business automation guy. I mean, that's what I would think of you as, because that's really what Excel is. It's a big macro for life and just because everything's numeric. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I totally get it. And I would really think Zapier, Zapier and Make, et cetera, would be the big thing for you, kind of a natural progression for automation. Exactly. And so the, the new set of courses are going to be focused a lot on online Excel, mm -hmm. online Zapier, how to connect everything, Airtable for all your database stuff, awesome. like all those kind of living on the cloud types of applications. And you don't teach, again, trading for dollars for time. You don't teach or you don't work with individual clients. You have people within your community that I bet you're kind of leaders who, if you will, who end up working with uh, the quote, clients for one time projects. Yeah, so we basically have for um, for the students who are active mm -hmm. um, in the membership, they get access to myself and TAs, which are students who have, like you say, kind of come up. Mm -hmm. And so those are all free and included in our training passes. If someone mm -hmm. has a really specific like project, though, that's m not training, but it's actually like a project, then I keep a list of consultants because yep. um, I don't do any consulting projects or, or yep. live sessions or anything like that anymore i used to um but now i i refer those out to to our you know consultants i would do that too and do you get uh, affiliate comp from that or no no i don't want any uh, i, I don't want any involvement in that they're strictly yeah. like independent third party and i advise do your own due diligence like these are not affiliated mm -hmm. with me there's no revenue coming back anything like that yeah so you can't be liable as an example correct yeah, I understand. Yeah, that's, I think it's it's absolutely brilliant, and I think uh, Google Sheets and Excel, <clears throat> um, Excel spreadsheet totally are smart. Uh, kind of something to base automation on, which is what you do. For one, that shows you could you're smart, you're numeric, calculative, etc. That you could be able to teach that, and then people continue to be members and grow, uh, and then um, grow with you as you add other products and services as well. Exactly, because at the end of the day. I'm not really selling Excel knowledge. What I'm selling yeah. is the efficiency that Excel knowledge gives you. Yeah. And so Excel is, is a major component, but there are so many other things. So I'm just trying to help my students through the journey and they started Excel. And then there's just other applications and other things that are really going to help them. So that's what I'm here to serve. And, and that's, you know, what I'm trying to support. Yeah. Are you doing gamification in your community? Tons of gamification, man. I got, um, I got XP level up, I got badges, I got all kinds of stuff. Yep. The coolest one though is, um, I don't know if you're a gamer, but like mm -hmm. in some video games, you it's just like um, kind of a free for all and you just kind of, you know, go. But some video games have like campaign mode or story mode where there's a, a like a, a storyline or a plot line that ties mm -hmm. all the levels together and you go through in this like progression. And so I was talking with my son, Jason, um, him, when him, when he and I play together, we make like a really good team. And so mm. I'm like, Hey, I'm trying to think about this thing for my Excel classes. And so we got to brainstorming. And so basically now I have this story mode inside the class. And so the idea is you would take a lesson mm. and then you would apply what you learned in that lesson to help campus security with their investigation. 
So I went all around town and mm -hmm. I shot all these really cool like cutscenes, intro, outro, and there's workbooks and there's a whole story that goes along with it. And so, um, <laughs> so you basically are motivated to keep progressing through the levels. And so yeah. that's, that's kind of the purpose of it. And it's super fun. Yeah. And I, I get a weird feeling and you didn't, I'm going to assume I'm right here. You didn't hire a coach to help you. Did you? I did not. No. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> You're a very interesting dude. You figured out the answer to a lot of people's issues and that's how to take, you know, how to trade dollars for time and turn it into a exactly what you've done. And somehow you did it kind of on your own. I'm sure you did a lot of research, et cetera, but you did it on your own, which is pretty, it's unbelievable. I, I would say unbelievable. How, what, what's the span of time? When did you start doing that? By the way, when did you start from day one with zero members to all of a sudden seven, 900 members? Yeah. So it's multiple years, I would say, um, see, there's just been so many different like phases from the yeah. live launch phase to all that kind of stuff. But basically to build the content, we can start there. It's about one year per course for me to plan and develop a course, create all the videos, create all the exercises, create all the, the relative book and all that stuff, launch it on Amazon, mm -hmm. all the things. So mm -hmm. there's um, six courses. So about six years of building the content. After that six year period is when I really then started focusing on, okay, I don't know marketing. I'm an introverted accounting CPA uh, like uh, nerd, right? Uh, like uh, after school, like computer programming club in junior high, like that kind of a dude. Uh, and so trying to figure out marketing was a challenge for me. And so, yes, uh, I've read tons of books. I have been in groups um, with mentors and, and that kind of thing. Uh, uh, um, but in, this, in the last few years have been more surround, uh, more uh, set up to kind of figure out how the marketing and, and the membership piece works. I understand. And, is the long answer. And, yeah. And I'm going to guess you don't coach people on that either, huh? If someone wanted to hire you for that, you don't do that really, huh? I don't. Um, I yeah. kind of just try to stick to my wheelhouse, which to yeah. me is really all the accounting and Excel and the computer kind of stuff. Um, but I'd be happy to share everything I've learned along the way because I've hit some roadblocks and had to make pivots, you know? So, mm. um, yeah. That's where I, I'm sure you're great with Excel or whatever, but I think you add, that's where you could add value to a lot of people because dude, people don't like, you know, I don't think working, you know, trading time for dollars. I think it's, it's a tough, tough, tough undertaking. And I think if people could move to recurring revenue and <laughs> sitting in their jammies or from in Disneyland, they'd be a lot happier. So, so wait a minute. So, cause we, as an example, are we've been around since 1969. I took over in 06 and we, uh, we have mass content. Right. We have a lot of content. And I think a lot of the people out there have a lot of content as well. If they're not posting on social media, they just have it from all the videos that they're doing that they could use as content. And so that's what we're doing. We're we're putting all of our content online behind a paywall and we're doing specific content for people who we want to be members who've you know done an application to be a part of that. And I think that's it's a little bit easier to make that transition. Does that make sense from the old school of time for dollars to at least starting the membership? It's easier than people think. That's what I would say. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, it's it's and it can grow. It's not like you have right. to have the full product line before you launch. Like that's I launched after my first of six modules, you know, and and then you launch. And so, yeah, you don't have to wait for everything to be perfect and everything to be done. But um, in talking about making the switch from time for dollars to more of a productized service um, built to sell is the book that is very um, good at explaining that whole conversion from a service hourly bill thing to a yeah. product that you build and then sell access to it. So that would be a great reference built to sell built to sell. And who's it by, do you know? Ah, I it doesn't matter. Name. Built. Built to sell, no big deal. Um, and there's also a book, uh, One to Many by, um, anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, okay. So, and, we, and we're in the point, I'll just talk about us for a little bit. So we've got in our database, 10,000 people. We merged with a law firm, yeah, 10,000, um, really 12,000. But um, we built, uh, or merged with a law firm, they have 6,000. And by the way, that entity is called vastassetdefense.com. Um, and it's a law firm that does asset protection and state planning. Anyway, so we have a huge database and we are slowly going to be letting people know, be a part of the community, 29 bucks a month or whatever. It's added value. So I think our people are going to learn from that. But when, what about, what are, what are your thoughts about making that kind of transition from what we've been doing 
to you know the, the new model in letting our clients, prospects, and our database know? What are some suggestions you would provide there? Yeah, so in terms of the messaging mm. for how to communicate the value of the thing that you're providing to them is mm -hmm. uh, Alex Hermosi, $100 million offers, yep. Yep. right? Yep. And he's he taught me basically how do you talk to people about this? Like I'm, I'm not a pushy sales dude, right? I'm this introvert. So he's mm -hmm. able to kind of help me figure out what, how is the message? What does this introduction look like? What are the common objectives? How do you set up bonuses that meet those objections? Um, and all of those kinds of things, because the offer is not just, it's $29 a month in exchange for this. It's a whole, it's, it's much bigger than that. And so I would recommend checking that out for some specifics, but but he's helped me in terms of um, communicating my message out to prospective students. Yeah, as a mentor, or you've read his book. His book, all through yeah. his book. Yeah, I and got it. YouTube video and YouTube videos. Which he's a lot. He's out there on social media. He and his wife. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna change a little bit, and I'm gonna get back to what we're talking about. But uh, Excel spreadsheet, you gotta be really smart for that. So, but let's say I'm just a normal businessman, which I am. Um, do I have time to learn it in a membership, meaning the stuff that you're going to teach me or just hire someone to do it? I mean, I guess you're going to say it depends, but like that's a big undertaking to be a part of your group. But I think it makes sense in a lot of cases because you're going to teach me how to automate, systematize my business. But it seems some people might say, well, that's a lot of work to be a part of that. If I don't I mean the part of the community, if I don't want to learn about it myself, get what I'm saying? I agree. So the concept for me is I've always been, I'd rather teach you how to fish than to just mm. give you a fish. Yeah. And so if I create a workbook or a template for you, as soon as I hand it off to you, it's going to break. You don't know how to maintain it. Right. If something goes wrong, you're going to be stressed out because the thing is due tomorrow and I'm not around. So you're going to try to text me to say, Hey Jeff, I need this for tomorrow. Like, do you see how that creates yep. that situation? Yep. So yep. even if that's what they think that they want, I don't, I don't do that. I help you and I truly help you where you are in terms of your Excel proficiency and skills so that you can be independent, build the workbooks that you want to build. Cause honestly, there's no template that fits everyone's Everybody. business. Seat. Like everything is so custom anyways. So wait a minute. So that just hit me. So for 29 bucks, is there a buy-in one time buy-in or no? No, it's huh. monthly, month to month. So I get a template, I get a bunch of templates, meaning Excel or whatever, Google Sheet templates? No, there's no templates. I don't sell or oh, offer said, templates. Oh, I thought you said template. You do. I got it, got it, got it. Because you teach us how to build them. I, oh, I understand. Yeah. Yes. I'm saying if yeah. I were to provide templates, it's, oh. you're not going to know how to customize it or, or build because you're going to break it and the formulas are, you know, you don't understand the formulas and the functions. Yeah, I bet you, and I bet you your courses are very fundamental at first and really build on one another because not very many people or I won't say not very many people. A lot of people aren't totally technically proficient, so they need the basic understanding. This is a macro as an example. Yeah, and that's how I've organized the content. And so like if you're taking existing content and trying to bundle it, you know, here's basically what I did is I just introduced and with Excel, I'm very comfortable talking about what things are dependencies of what other knowledge in other words i know i can't even have a discussion with you about pivot tables until i first talk with you about tables and yeah. i can't even talk about tables until i talk about defined names so it's yeah. set up in a very strict logical progression so everybody can get into this one training platform and start at the beginning and then work through and if they encounter a lesson where they already know about v lookup fine take the quiz and move on but it's designed to start at the beginning and work through sequentially in order. Mm, I get it. I totally get it. I get it. And I bet you you have little churn because people are learning uh, churn, meaning people coming and going. Um, I got to assume because people want to be long term because it stacks on itself, meaning the it's information. Stacked. Everything stacks. Correct. Correct. And so that's another example. Like if we, te if we talk about um, concatenation. We'll talk about that, but then I'm going to, I'm going to, wait, what? That. <laughs> That's an Excel where you're joining two cell text values together. Oh, anyway, okay. but my point is I am merging. Okay. Yeah. But then we revisit that topic like 10 more times. And so it's all building this foundation mm -hmm. because, you know, I'm not sure about the things in your business, but for me, it's, it's not just like one thing. Like, it's not just about V lookup. 
for a workbook to function efficiently, it's like 10 different Excel things all working together in harmony. So mm -hmm. we introduce it and then we keep revisiting it and adding on as we go. Mm, I understand. Yeah, I think a lot of the stuff you're teaching would work well in our AI system. We call it Einstein. We use, you know, as you know, we do tax finance and artificial intelligence to lower tax liability. And, and a lot of our stuff, I mean, we're AI is, for us is really business automation. And if we could combine some of the stuff that you're teaching onto our platform, I would think it'd be huge. And then com uh, even combining with Zapier would be really big. Hmm. I get it. All right. Let me ask a few more questions. We only have about whatever, seven minutes. So, um, wow, it, that's an incredible deal you have going on. What, what else, what other words of wisdom would you give to someone who wants to move from the old way, old school way of doing things like time for dollars, uh, uh, you know, yeah, exactly. Time for dollars, or, or kind of the, the new way of, you know, passive income or really recurring income, et cetera, et cetera. What other words of wisdom would you provide? Yeah. The first thing is your asset is your email list. Mm -hmm. So don't get caught up in building an audience and all these different platforms over which you have zero control, build your email list and your rapport with your prospects. Um, and so that's going to be some probably weekly, maybe monthly, I don't know, but some cadence that you can maintain where you're communicating with them and giving them just value, no sales, just value, 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 value. And then I figured about quarterly, is when your offer goes out and then your offer can be anything from check out this webinar to hey the course is opening now for registration so now's a good time to get in to uh, you know a 20% discount or some type of offer about every quarter but keep your email list because you control it you can move into other applications you can use active campaign you can use some of the other email providers but you now own that list and that asset and that is that's the only marketing you really need is marketing to your email list so build that email list keep it protect it and nurture it that would be my best advice it's funny that I was just uh, talking to a guy yesterday, a big mar marketing guru, and you know he's talking about, and I get it, you know, talking about spending money on marketing with Facebook, with Google. I'm like, well, wait a minute, what about all these people who already have huge email lists? All they have to, in my opinion, all they have to do is market to that list. You know, there's going to be a higher open rate. They don't have to spend as much money because, well, now numbers show it's one to forty. If you invest a dollar, you're going to get forty dollars in return on your own email email list versus spending, you know, tons of money on Facebook. I mean, I mean, people have money right in front of them and they're walking over it to go after the Facebook crowd. Yeah. You know, I, in the, in the old days, I've experimented with every different kind of thing. Mm. And mm. what I found is that if I'm trying to convince you to buy something the first time you meet me, it's like 0%. Yeah. Yeah. So that's why I'm saying getting them into your email list and then providing value over time. They know, like, and trust you. And that's when the sales are going to occur. It's not some, at least I haven't been able to figure out how to throw an ad up and for you to go, wow, I'm going to buy that Excel course. Like, mm -hmm. no. So if I were to advertise in other platforms, it's going to be more about giving you something free to get into my email list so that I can provide value to you over time. I was going to ask, that's how you're getting, growing your list is providing stuff free, which we, we do with our, you know, our new captive or our new uh, community, as a matter of fact, here, it's free. You know, I'm being blunt for everyone out there. We kind of tease a little bit, and then hopefully the thought is people are going to go into our $29 community and then hopefully work with us. Also, by the way, what that does is it gets rid of needing a sales force because, you know, having a sales force is tough, man. It's really tough. So now if someone wants to learn from us, be a part of the community, learn from us, then hopefully go up to the $29 deal, and then hopefully they'll say, hmm, I need a little bit of help. For us, they would come to us. For you, they'd go to one of your consultants, but the thought is they can go up the value value chain, if you will, and um, you know they'll at that point when they really want to do something with us, they'll know, like, and trust, and we'll know they know and like us, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah. So in your case, that twenty nine is just a link in the chain to get to the mm -hmm. higher ticket item. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. Because twenty nine dollars that'll get you, you know, for us, it's a you know five percent off of our services, by the way. But for us, also, you know, once a month. Uh, vast cast, which is think of it as a webinar. And then they get, you know, they're going to always have new content in there, but if they want, if they truly want individual help and they can afford it, then they come to us for true consulting. So it's customized, but otherwise, you know, we're expensive. Sometimes it too expensive for maybe a, a business that's starting out, you know what I mean? Especially if we're doing tax and finance stuff for them, you know, 
Um, and so, yeah, you get it. We're just basically a more junior version of you as it relates to that, even though we've been around for years, because we're from the kind of the old school world back in the, you know, 60s or 70s of, you know, trying to, <laughs> trying to, you know, here, go to the client, look at their tax return, et cetera, et cetera. We're trying to educate them maybe so they can do their own taxes. And if they need us to stand in, they can pay for us to provide the service. Yeah. And you're meeting people where, where they are in their journey with you. So right. I think right. it's brilliant. Yeah. 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 Wow. Uh, thanks. Um, it sounds like I want to be uh, like Jeff Lenning when I grow up. Um, well, <laughs> well, let's say someone wants to join your community because it's such a cool community and they can learn marketing and so they could see what it is that you're doing. How does someone join? Yeah, so xl-university.com slash tips to get my free Excel newsletter that provides Excel tips. That's free. And then also Excel, and there, by the way, there's a hyphen in there. So xl-university.com slash tips. Then there's also a free Excel course. And the idea with that course is that you can get in and you can learn five things that are going to give you the most uh, efficiency within Excel. And then if you'd like to dig deeper, then we'd offer you the, you know, the discount on the paid course, uh, paid program. Yep, 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 yep. I dig it. I'm so glad. Yeah. You mean if they pass that or whatever, then that's when they get the discount. Yeah. So once they yeah. kind of sign up for that, they go through that. And then, you know, we follow up with, um, you know, some, some polite emails basically saying, Hey, if you had a good time and you'd like <laughs> to dig deeper on these features, then, you know, consider, consider, you know, joining our program. And those are all automated emails, by the way. Yeah. Everything's automated, man. Everything yeah. is automated. So, and you're, by taking your courses, people will know how to do that because they'll be able to watch you in action. Correct. So the courses are all like video that has screen sharing. So mm -hmm. like my face is down or actually some of them are off camera. Some of them are on, some of them are off camera, but basically you're watching my Excel screen, you get the workbook. And so I'm like, okay, let's insert the sum function, alt equals. Okay. Then you mm -hmm. can pause it, go to your Excel, do the thing. And that way you're really learning hands-on instead of just watching a video where it's easy mm -hmm. to go. Yeah, I got that. <laughs> but the learning yeah. comes in when you're doing the hands-on exercises. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Brilliant. Brilliant, man. People really should reach out to you. Not only if they want to know Excel, but also if they want to know business automation and also marketing to watch your business only for 29 bucks a month. That's, that seems like a really good deal. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I am totally happy to help. Sounds good, man. Hey, everyone, take Jeff up on his offer. Do the free thing. Do the course. Get the discount. 29 bucks a month. And you can learn business automation, marketing. You can learn the whole deal from uh, from Jeff the Excel, man. <laughs> um, everyone, thanks for uh, watching, listening. Hopefully, we're add, adding value to you. I would say, based on the few minutes we've spent with Jeff, we are adding value, and he totally will add value. This has been a huge pleasure spending time with you, Jeff, and also all the people out there. Once again, this is Kenner French. Stop by our website if you need anything, by the way. Uh, it's at vastsolutionsgroup.com, vastsolutionsgroup.com. And once again, I'm Kenner. I happen to run the place. Uh, if you want to get a hold of us or give us any input, info at vastsolutionsgroup.com. Once again, va info at vastsolutionsgroup.com. Thank you, everybody. That was good.